Hello. Today I'm going to show you how you can receive an alternative phone number from Google Voice that will let you make and receive phone calls in addition to writing, receiving, and responding to texts. First, you need to open Google Chrome or whatever web browser you're using. Then you need to search for Google Voice. I see here that it's the first returned link, Google Voice. It also gives me the address, voice.google.com. I click on it. Then on the upper right, I see the blue sign-in button. I click on that. And then it asks for my Google account. Now, I made one earlier Google account that you saw in my video or that you might have seen in my video and that was this one. I also put a thought bubble into that first video that said you could actually also use your district email as your Google account. It depends on your preference. So for the demonstration today, I'll click on the Hillsborough email address that is also serving as my Google account and then I'll click next. It's going to ask me for my password. I supply that. Click next. Then it asks me to search for available numbers. You could hit skip this and Google Voice would just give you a number. I'll put in 813 and see what comes up. I'll pick a number that appeals to me. There's also the option to show more at the bottom. I'll pick this one. It's letting me know what I selected and it's also letting me know that it needs to verify that I have an existing cell phone number that it can link up with the Google Voice number. I'm going to verify, so I click verify and then I input my mobile phone number. And then I click send code and I should be receiving a six digit code that I will have to input shortly. I received the code, so now I will input it. Then I click verify. And I get a message saying that everything was successful. I click on finish. And Google Voice is letting me know that the phone number is now mine. And it's letting, also letting me know that I can use Google Voice on a phone that's running iOS, uh, iPhone. I could use it on any other phone that's running on Android. Or I could access Google Voice through the web, which is what I was doing today. In later videos, I'll show you how to utilize Google Voice through the web. Thank you.